YouTube, what's good? It's that guy boy Kyle, Fit Soldier. Coming to you with a QA. I've been getting a lot of requests for this QA. So there we go, man. I decided what I'm gonna do, since I'm getting a lot of questions on it, on a lot of the basic training and AIT and fitness, and I'm been getting a lot of questions and a lot of requests for this QA. So I'm gonna do this in like episodes. So this will be like episode one. That way, you know, cause I can't go through all the questions just in one video. I don't wanna make the video too long. So I'm gonna answer about three, four, maybe five. See how fast it goes. And uh, you know, I'll just do a bunch of episodes and you know what I'm saying? Try to get y'all questions answered, okay? Uh, but before I start that, let me give you a quick update. Um, still on the four day, four day on, one day off split. Uh, that's what I'm doing at the gym right now. And uh, as far as military, drill still going good. Um, I applied for the air assault school, so waiting to see if I got accepted to go to that. So uh, it's gonna be intense, man. I know it's in, um, I know it's uh, February, I think. So I'm trying to train my body for that. And then you gotta do like a 12 mile walk in like three hours or something like that. It's, it's crazy. So I'm trying to get my body right for that. Anyway, so yeah, that's about it. Then um, what I'm gonna try to do with these videos, I'm gonna try to upload more because I know you guys be waiting on me to upload videos. So, what, I'm, what the plan is, you know, I gotta be a nice, fresh ass camera. So, I'm gonna just try to figure out how to use that thing. And it will take me a couple days, you know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna try to upload one fitness video, like on a Monday or a Tuesday, and then like a military based video, uh, maybe a, like a video on updates or a QA or, you know, military questions and, and stuff like that, like at the end of the week. That way, uh, you have these two or three videos per week. So I'm gonna start getting on the ball with these videos. Alright? So just be patient, man. Alright, anyway. I'm just gonna... Uh, I picked out a couple of questions I saw. So let me just go through it real quick. Ah, uh, let's see. Most of these, I, I get like the same questions over and over. So... Obviously, those are the ones that people really want to know uh, things about. So, let me see here. Yeah. Alright, this question is from Jazz underscore I underscore AM25. I am joining the military older 27 in January. Was it different or harder? for you because of the age. I get that a lot. Uh, I mean, it depends on your fitness level. And I think it's actually easier when you're older because your, men your mentality is, is, is different. So, you know, you're gonna see a lot of kids and a lot of them break down. You're gonna see a lot of crying. People wanna quit and stuff like that. The older people, they really like, you know, they were, we were sticking it out, like, that stuff, the shouting and all the doing push-ups and all that didn't really bother us like that. It's just the kids, like, they couldn't handle it. A lot of people, you know, want to hurt themselves or uh, they want to quit because they think it's too hard. But, you know, when you're older, you know it's only a two-month training, so at the end, you're going to get through it. The only thing is... It's harder when you're older for the fitness, you know what I'm saying? Because those kids, they were running circles around me. I mean, I did good in my PT, my PT score and everything, but come on. Like, <laughs> those dudes were running circles around me. I remember this one dude laughed me during the, the two-mile run. I was like, you know, you can't let it bother you, but 
But as far as the mentality, to see him gotta lap me, you know, to see him went crying. Oh, I can't do these push-ups. Or oh, I don't want to wake up at five in the morning. You know what I'm saying? So it's 50-50. Like, I actually think it's better when you go when you're older. So, I mean, you'll be fine. Just get your fitness on point. And that's the major thing. Just get your fitness on point. Because you're going to be doing a lot of running. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? At least try to go to the range. Get comfortable with a weapon. Because that's the major thing too. Qualifications. Alright, so. Let me see here. Next one. This one is from... Jalicia Norwood. My brother is thinking of joining the army. What do you think he need to do to pass basic training? Uh, it's kind of similar to the last question. Well, it depends on his age too. I mean, everybody needs to do the same thing to pass basic training. Uh, sorry if, you, if I sound stuffed up. My nose is like really stuffy. The weather changed, so I think I'm getting like a cold, but anyway. So yeah, to pass basic training, you have different phases. Um, you definitely gotta you gotta pass your APFT, which is your score. Um, so he needs to get get in the gym now, start running, start getting his body right, uh, and start studying. Like I don't know if he still spoke to recruit already. You know, get your soldier's handbook, start studying that stuff. You're gonna have like a a red phase test also, and it's gonna be. It's gonna be about a lot of things in the book about the military drills, uh, you know, how to take apart a weapon, the M16, and different things like that. So you need to get that, get that going. You know, you gotta study uh, and train your, your your mind, man. It's all mental. Basic training is all mental, guys. Like when you're done with it, you're gonna be like, ooh, ooh, ooh. like I can't believe I was freaking out over this stuff. Like, come on. So first thing, get your mentality right, focus, study, and train your body. That's basically all you need to do to pass basic training and be good at it and you'll be fine. Alright, let's see. Next question from Egan, Egan Hardy. I have a question. So I'm going in for a Canon crew member, 13 Bravo. Ooh. And I am really into going to the gym. I would like to take it more seriously. Uh, you can put in brackets, diet, routine, etc. My question to you is, do you think I will have enough time or energy, LOL, to be a bodybuilder while working? Uh, in one short answer, yes. Like, yes, you will. I mean, I work like two, three, three jobs. Like, I mean, I work one full time job, but I do contracts with two different other companies. So I work a lot. And I still find time to go to the gym, man. I wouldn't say I'm a bodybuilder, but, you know, I'm treating, I treat myself as fitness is like a lifestyle. So, Yes, I really do think you will have time. People, you can always have time to do everything. Anything you want to do, you can make time for it if you really if you really enjoy it and you really uh, want to do it. So, yeah, I think you'll have time, bro. Just make time. Like me, I go to the gym early in the morning. Because I know my day is always packed. If I wait till later, I'm not going to get it done. So I wake up sometimes 4, 5. You know what I'm saying? Go to the gym at 5.30, 6 a.m. and get it over with quick. So, yeah. I do think you can find time. All right, man, so don't be stressed out about it. <laughs> you get it done, bro. All right, guys, so my camera battery died, so I had to put a new battery in anyway. But this is gonna conclude the video, the Q&A for today. Um, like I said, check out episode 2, which is coming soon. I'll do the basic training um, and AIT 
more experience side in uh, episode two probably all right so look out for that coming soon all right anyway y'all be good don't forget to like comment subscribe share all right spread it out there man thanks for the love and be good stay fit all right by dark boy cow fit soldier Exercise.